entertainers here tonight for Cade. In fact, a very special entertainer for Cade because this guy, went. you went way out. This is Brett, of course. And, uh, Brett, you went way out, and you actually wrote a song for Cade. Absolutely. Um, it's called Fly for Cade. Um, it's an awesome song produced by the Matrix. And uh, Devin's on the hook, and we just went in, and I studied uh, what was going on with the organization. Um, my children suffer from asthma. It's dear to my heart, the organization, so I just let my heart out on it. It's really, really, really from here. That's all it is. Yeah, and that's what it's all about. I mean, because it's, what you know, people don't, I keep trying to stress, you know, people need to get on the Internet, research Cade, and find out what this is all about, because I never knew that the kids, uh, can you imagine laying there in pain, you know? Oh, I, absolutely, man. It's um, it's something that, like I said, it's dear to my heart, and then I have some family members that deal with sickle cell and autoimmune diseases, man. It's just when you find out uh, the suffering that goes on, and the, I never thought you, you of that. You do something. Yeah, you mentioned sickle cell. That I never thought of. That I guess that's kind of a because you look at that. That's kind of like a same similar relationship. It's similar. It's really similar. It's yeah. really similar, man. And um, when you see the reaction that the children are having when they hear the song. And they're getting up and they're able to get out of bed and they're sending pictures on Facebook and putting videos out and they're dancing. That's what I do it for. Yeah, and and, That's and, what I do. and it's all about fly. Yeah, and, and, yeah, the, and, yeah, and, yeah, I, yeah. and the kids like to fly. I'm telling you, when you they hear the song, that's what they want to do. Yeah. I see them jumping off for you know benches and everything else. I mean, Lisa. Know. I mean, Lisa's an amazing person, and when when we decided to do it, it was just automatic. And I didn't even know at the time that the logo was an eagle. I'm like wow, so we talking about this? Yeah, well, it's, it's, yeah well, it, it, that's that's the way things work out. Yeah, yeah, yeah. it's magic, you know. Yeah, it's magic. Well, a little plug for you because you're out there and you got a lot of things going on. Let's let's hear about what's going on with you right now. Uh, actually, uh, be in another movie coming up with Fontaine Vision. I just did one. Um, I have a new project coming out in June, music-wise. You can catch me on breadmusic.com, uh, Instagram, uh, Facebook, Twitter, Black Planet, Latino Planet. <laughs> yeah, you're, 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 you're out there, cause you, you, you know, but you're getting, you're getting out there, and uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. You know, we're independent now. Um, and I, I was on a major label, but I'm independent now, and we're just, you know, we're having fun with it. We're just having fun with it. Yeah, yeah. yeah. You're, you're doing a lot, of, a lot of good things. This is a fantastic cause you got involved with here. We want to thank you for that. Plus, on top of that, this song that you wrote. If you haven't heard it, you, you, you can find it on YouTube. You can find it on everything on YouTube. You can download it on Amazon on the website. You waiting on me, Joe? Is that, is that? Is that the problem here? Uh, you know, you and Janelle waiting on me. Uh, uh, Br Brad's holding me up. It's Brad's. It's, 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 it's his turn then. Oh, uh, we're gonna hear Brad right now, so we're gonna go to.
Well, part of the entertainment here at Stop King tonight was this young lady right here. I'm telling you, she blew me away. She blew a lot of crowd away. She's up and coming, rising star, Doreen Taylor. How are you? Great. How are you? Yeah, you came in from California, I understand. I did. I live in L.A. and I, well, I split my time. By, I'm by coastal, but I, I call Philadelphia home and I call L.A. home. Yeah, you're originally from this area then? Or? I grew up in Buffalo, New York, so I've been everywhere. Yeah, <laughs> I'm no. kind of a little of everything. Yeah, because I was listening to your music. It had a little country sound to it, but it could cross over. I mean, you, you Kind of do. Definitely crossover. I, a lot of people, like the critics and stuff, they've been calling me music. I'm country music for everybody. Yeah, because that, and that's what I, I gathered from and everything else. Now you got a new album coming out here soon, or? Oh no, I already have an album. Oh. Okay. Magic, literally and figuratively, it's actually called Magic. It came out last year, well, 2012, and we're actually starting our tour in May. Actually, at the World Cafe Live, May 23rd. You better be there. May 23rd, at cafe. Uh, that's and that's the one here in Philadelphia. Right in Philadelphia. It's a nonprofit. We're actually doing it with the Jaws Youth Playbook, which is Ron Jaworski's charity, yeah. and we're going to give all the uh, profits to Ron Jaworski's charity. Now you got to be excited because this is your second. And at the second annual Cade, I mean, what what a great organization this is. It's amazing to be back, and it's, you know, it's such an honor to be invited back to something because you know that you're doing something amazing, you're making a difference, and I, I couldn't think of anything that I would want to be doing right now other than being here. Yeah, because the kids, I try to tell people, you know, unless you physically can see what I've seen, and I've been to Lisa's house, I've heard a kid screaming at night, I mean, it just blows my mind that more people aren't aware. It's kind of a hidden secret in the medical field. I'm surprised a lot of doctors don't even know what they're looking at. It's amazing because you also, me as, as an adult, I have experienced my own that is very similar to what these children are going through. And, you know, a lot of people don't realize that I've been going through that as well. So to feel these children who don't understand, they don't realize, I'm an adult, I can deal with things differently. They don't know. They don't know what their bodies are telling them. They, they just know pain. And, you know, you, I saw the video earlier tonight here at this event. I You cannot be... Not I had I had I, I had to leave the room. I, I know I can't watch. You I, get tears in your eyes. And I, I you know it's how, how do you, how do you t you know when a child's laying there in that kind of pain looking up to you're making and, me cry now. Yeah, well just and just saying to you help me. You know uh, you I know it's like a, it's like an animal a child anything that's helpless that needs you, and that's why this is such an amazing event because I I especially personally I want to speak for those that can't speak for themselves. So a charity like this speaks to me. Yeah. I want to be there for them. And we know we, we, we all, th all throughout the show here, we've been putting uh, how you can get involved with the Stop Cave now. You know, this is just one event with uh, a lot more things planned for the future because this is it's a young organization because oh, it's yeah. uh, because they're just getting started. And Lisa, when her children got came down with this, we got a young lady that's very aggressive and she's going to try to find this cure as well, quickly. She's amazing. I, I mean, I was learning things tonight myself that I didn't even know. I mean, the, the, the lead leaps and bounds that this woman has done for this organization and this cause is incredible. And anyone who doesn't recognize this and, and acknowledge this, that this is an amazing cause and organization, I don't know. I just write them off in my book. They, yeah. need, to, they need to recognize it. <laughs> uh, once again, I, I want to be sure you get your, yourself and that plug out there for you and, and you know, and get your album because that, that's important. I mean, because you're, you're, you're going to be one of those overnight success. Cause, I'm getting there. I'll yeah. tell you, a lot of people are saying it's overnight and it is kind of. Uh, uh, it's not overnight. No. Me, I've been working at this business a long time. Yeah, people don't understand all the. I'm only 15, right? Yeah. You know. as, soon, well, as soon as you make it, it's an overnight success, but you've only right, been doing right. it for 30 years. Of course, yeah. of course. Yeah, but lots of luck to you, and thank, <laughs> thank you so you. much for giving your time to Cage. Thank you very much for uh, talking to me.